So yeah, I know, I said I'd be doing a submission video a while ago, but it's taken a wee while, but here it is, hope you guys enjoy. Okay, so here's what happened. Be me. 15 meters closet gay want to be a trap. Find this thing on reddit called r sharpie but. Basically you put as many sharpies in your ass as you can fit. Other people saying they struggled at 4. Have a cup full of sharpies that I bought years ago. Wait till family are all leaving the house. Check that there'll be a few hours. Ok.jpg. Shave ass. Cock. Stick finger in ass to test it. Covered in shit.mov. Go have a shit. Have a shower to wash my ass instead because I sometimes do that. Lightbulb.mp3. Turn up shower pressure to max. Put the shower head to my anus. Immediately feel it flowing in. When I feel completely full I take the shower away from my ass. Hold it for a few seconds. Let loose. A lot of shit and water. Repeat steps 2 through 4 dot recipe. No longer any shit coming out. Just clean water. Go back to bedroom. Dry off. Move mirror to end of bed so I can watch my ass get penetrated. Lube up. Try the challenge. Got 16 on my first attempt. Jiggle them around with my hand. Come. Put them back in cup clean myself up. Do this every week for about a year. One day. Mum walks in. Anna you have some markers don't you? Could I borrow them? I want to make a costume for Easter. Realize I never wiped the lube off of the sharpies. Try desperately to stop her. Try desperately to wipe off the lube as I make up some excuse to count them. Give up. She takes them. This happened 10 minutes ago please I need advice. What do I do? Hospital I work at hires a retard to haul trash. He basically runs around with a full size dumpster strapped at him. Yes. Strapped at him. Always talking shit and spreading lies. Told me he wanks it at least 4 times a day. Calls everyone boss. Revealed to me one day he carries a terrorist judge in case anyone attacks him. Tells me one day that he sees turkeys in his neighborhood often. Convince him to hunt the turkeys with his judge. My face when he shows me a picture of a dead turkey that he shot in a downtown residential neighborhood. I laughed hard, but try not to get his guns taken away okay. Picturing a retard running around with a revolver chasing turkeys hearty keck. B30. See a bat of kokido in the fridge. Taste sample. Shit so good. I read on the cover saying do not eat raw cookie dough. Fuck that shit.jpg. Eat several spoonfuls of cookie dough. Shit was so cash. Later. Middle of the night sleeping. Wake up due to a bad smell. My butt cheeks feel wet. Open covers. There was liquid shit seeping out of my asshole. Puddle of shit on my bed. Stomach groans. Oh fuck. Rush to bathroom. Sit on the toilet. It's like a volcano except for lava. It's liquid shit. Could be worse. Liquid shit replaced by chuck shit. Stomach groans more. The shit gets harder and harder. The stench was awful. My butt cheeks were slapping together so rapidly that my ass was bruised. It stops. Falls on the floor. Stomach grumbles again. Can't shit in the toilet because there is not enough room. Got in the bathtub. Shit my fucking brains out. It hurts so bad I start to cry. Crying while pushing out a colossal turd out of my asshole. Stops again. Back is covered with poo. Falls on the floor. Ghost of Billy Maze's head peeps out of my asshole. But wait there's more. Shit starts blasting out of asshole like two grizzly bears tearing my ass apart. Door is complete brown in shit. Parents comes downstairs. Hearing crying and moaning in the bathroom. Hear my dad say what the fuck is that smell. He notices shit escaping from the bottom of the door. Anon what the fuck are you doing in there? He busts down the door. He gets completely spray paint with shit. Mom vomits. L start to cry again never eating cookie dough again. Want to play a trick on faggot son. Spunk and put laxatives in cookie dough. That'll show the little cunt. Later that night. Hear girly screams and loud blasts of shit coming from downstairs. Gotcha. Run downstairs. See shit coming from bottom of door. Hear Billy Mays. Rot. Blast through. Sprayed with liquid shit. Wife vomits. Son begins to cry like a girl. Gently easy my rock solid penis into his freshly lubricated asshole. Be container of raw cookie dough. Expecting to get baked into delicious cookies. Nobody will eat me until then. Hell. It say right on my cover do not eat raw cookie dough. Fat fucker opens the fridge. Looks at me. Oh hell no dot png. Don't you fucking dare you faggot dot wav. He fucking does. Decide to make the fat shit pay for robbing me of my baked deliciousness. Group all the chunks up just inside his asshole. Start off slow. See bow just enough to wake the nigger up. He notices. Go time. Push with all my might. 
fat faggot manages to make it to the toilet before I start exploding out his anus. But I ain't letting up here. Slap the fucker's butt cheeks together so hard his ass gets bruised. Keep fill up whole toilet. Faggot moves over to bathtub crying. I am just warming up dot eggs. Push a massive chunk out to cause him unimaginable pain. Decide to add insult to injury. Vibrate his ass cheeks are just the right frequency so it sounds like Billy Mays yelling but wait there's more. Faggot's dad opens the door. Laugh maniacally as I shoot the rest of me out as fast as I can. Coating his dad and the rest of the walls in shit. That'll teach that fat nigga to eat raw fucking cookie dough. Hear that, you fat fuck. You don't fuck with raw cookie dough. Be toilet. Feeling quite lonely. Nobody used me in a while. Middle of the night. Just chilling in the dark. All of a sudden, this fat fucker bursts into the bathroom. Oh no dot jpg. Faggot releases a Kamehameha blast of shit in me. Entire mouth is full of shit. Friend bathtub staring at me in horror. Faggot goes in the bathtub, releasing a shadow of the colossus turd. Friend dies. Faggot dad breaks into door, killing Mr. Door. He gets covered in shit. Feels bad man. JPG. Be spoon. Chilling with fork wife. Shit was so cash. All of a sudden, this fat faggot fuck opens the drawer and stole me. Scared as fuck. Jams me in Ms. Cookie Dough. She felt good to be inside off. Feel ashamed because I am married. Kid about to jam me in his mouth. Please no. JPG. He does it. He does this several times. Return with my wife. I'm a dirty spoon. Sleeping with wife. L hear the fat faggot crying and moaning in the bathroom. Serves that fucker right. Be Billy Mays ghost. Some kid taking a fat shit. His face tells me he thinks it's nearly over. Lol no. Be me. In class. On school computers. Bored as fuck. Gets out USB. Looks in USB for 5 minutes for shit posts. Finds a GIF file that I forgot I had. Opens it. Opens it to find a GIF of sweaty Danny DeVito crawling out of Kim Kardashian's ass. A few classmates see. Bitch teacher sees it as well. Bitch teacher yells at me to go to deputy principal's office. Deputy principal takes my shit post USB. Deputy principal searches for porn on my shit post USB. She finds nothing. Gives back shit post USB and gets a warning. My face when I got into trouble for a GIF file of a sweaty Danny DeVito crawling out of Kim Kardashian's ass. My face when the school thinks I am a serial killer in the making. PewDP makes a video about green text. Influx of new fags and normies asking where can I find the green text memes. 4chan's user base grows 30% in one week my face when. Help, Roberts 9000. I just masturbated to Chris Chan. Willy Wanka. I'm serious. I'm not trolling or anything to get attention. I really just did this. Before I begin to explain, I'd like to tell Chris that sadly, I am not a boyfriend free girl, but a dude. Be me, be skinny, relatively normal looking high school student who eats healthy and has good hygiene secretly an extremely depraved bisexual pervert who faps to hente most of the time. Normal pom no longer makes me excited, as I fap anywhere from 1-3 times a day. Thus, my fetishes get worse every day. Have an extreme thing for asses. At home. Finish eating dinner with my sister. Decide to look at the CWCKI on my phone for the 50th time this week. Tap the random button and find an article that's about Chris giving naked pics to Jackie or something see his ass and have an epiphany. As I said, my fetishes have been getting worse. I've increasingly been looking at more fucked up shit, because I no longer get hard from the normal stuff. For a moment, I see Chris's flabby ass cheeks as illustrious round bubbles chiseled by the gods themselves. Dick begins to fire like Eric Harris, run out of the living room and go upstairs to let my ding dong explode as Ella intended. If you're wondering why I went upstairs to jack off instead of my room, it's because I have frenulum breathe, which is a condition where the strength thing on your wee wee is too short for you to pull back the foreskin over the head of your cock. So basically in order to get off, I have to hump my couch, as that stimulates the penis head. This is one of the other reasons why I grew up to be a sexual degenerate. Find a video of Chris smacking his ass. Begin rubbing it on the couch to the video. Feel a bit of guilt, I stop for a moment. It was just plain weird. Why am I doing this? The ass was just too fat. Continue pretending the couch was a bubble butt of the Ms. Doubtfire lookalike from the video. While getting off, I search for more videos of Chris's fat material. Find a video of him sitting on a cake with his blubbery whale cheeks. 
this gets the little diglet pumping even more. Switch between both videos as I am making the couch move back and forth. I feel the climax is coming. Speed up Super Sonichu style. My little Sonichu is zapping to the fucking extreme. Come rivers in my little boy pants. Inspect the mess I made in my undies. It always makes me a little proud to see how big my load was. Kind of like when you take a massive shit and just stare at the log bobbing up and down in the toilet water for 10 minutes in awe. The post-masturbation guilt smacks me in the face like a 10 inch dragon dildo. Ponder how everything in my life had gone so wrong to make me masturbate to a man who shits his pants. And that's basically what happened like 10 minutes ago. This is the first time I've done it to him. But honestly, it may not be the last. Send help. 6am on a Saturday. Finished 10 hours shift at shitty job 2 hours ago. Sleeping peacefully. Honk honk honk. Ignore it. Honk 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 honk. Wake up. I am fucking pissed. People near me have been feeding birds when they wake up for god knows what reason. Walk outside I live in a rural area near a lake. Fucking geese sitting there like faggots just all look up at me. I am sleep deprived and out of it thought they were challenging me. Shout shut the fuck up bird niggas it's too early for this shit. Onk. One walks close to me expecting food. Seriously fucker dot jpg. Shoo asshole you're in season next month. Walk away tries to peck me and kick him away. Honk 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 here come the rest of them. Get inside my house with a few pecks and pissed as fuck. Find rifle. Buy bird food. Buy cheap pans. Buy tannerite. Set up Canadian geese led in a field near the lake where I know these fuckers feed. Idea was to scare them away. Wall 2 hours until a bunch of them land and start feeding next to my ID. Do I really wanna get reported for poaching with unled? Fuck yes they've annoyed me for 3 weeks straight. Shoot boom. Isis would be proud. 10 died immediately rest got PTSD and never fucking bothered me again. Fuck geese man. Literally the jamals of the bird world. Typical everyday average British morning. Wake up. Bobby knocks on door. Oil open up you cheeky 47 kilobytes jpg. Bastard and show me your sleeping license. Fumble around and finally find my license. Sorry good sir. It's right here. God save the queen. Bobby peers in and catches a glimpse of me telly. Halt. Where's your TV license you cunt? Draw TV license from me wallet. Bobby gives a look like the bloody queen's dodger. Oh I mate. Where's your permit for this license? Show him my license permit. This license permit is expired. I'm taking you in. Bobby draws his toy gun. Stab him with my unregistered buttock knife. <laughs> Buy musket for home defense. Finally one night I hear a crash. Dawn my powdered wig and petticoat. Musket is ready to fire. My home surround sound is also primed and ready to play the royal huzzas. Hit play. Tally ho lads. Run downstairs and into my living room. Two men are carrying my TV. Put a basketball sized hole in one. The other attempts to drop my TV and run. Affix bayonets gentleman. Charge after him. Jam my bayonet into his anus as he tries to climb back through a broken window. Call police. Have tea ready for them. So I hope you guys have enjoyed. If you want to share some of your screenshots, maybe get into a video somewhere down the line. If you think it's funny or entertaining enough, make sure to just take a wee screenshot, join the Discord, put it into the submissions channel, and I'll probably do this maybe once a month or so. It just depends on how long it takes me to actually get enough submissions to make a video out of, you know what I mean? I want to make it a minimum of 10 minutes long. But anyway, anyway, uh, be sure to like and subscribe and all that there good gear. Also be sure to check out the links for merch. Got some nice looking t-shirt designs you guys will love. This, this is, is not okay. This needs to stop now. This is cancer. This, this is so much cancer that I can feel the tumors growing on my back. And it's way down heavy on me and it's not okay. Can you help a nigga out and just stop this? Please?